Good morning. It's your big buddy, Brad, and I've got a very different video for you today. We're going to talk about one of my favorite subjects, commercial property. Do you want to learn how to make real money real fast and grow your net worth for you and your family and have a good cash flow at the same time? Commercial property is something that our family loves. Hold to the end. You're going to see an amazing opportunity. There are two kinds of people. There are people who just sit back and wait for things to happen to them, and that's way too passive to ever get ahead. The other kind of people are entrepreneurs who say, heck, I can do better than that. This guy is a sweet man. I spent a couple hours with him, but he has got himself convinced there's nothing he can do to help his failing business. The location is golden. The building and the income is a platinum opportunity, if you can see it. Tell me what he's doing wrong. Put it in the comments below. Hey, help me with the algorithm, will you please? Like and comment, I would really appreciate it. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe, because we do all kinds of crazy stuff. Yes, it's mostly lifestyle farms. Yes, it's mostly green grass and cows and horses and pretty things like that. But hey, you gotta live too, right? So this is where your income comes from, a commercial property. Stay tuned, I'll give you all the details. Hold tight. Now, five miles back is Danville which you know is a great place. This is 127. And this connects up here to Harrodsburg. Now, Lexington's not too far away, maybe 30 minutes or so, 40 minutes. But this road gets uh, quite a bit of traffic on it, about 16,000 daily traffic count, which is decent. It's a US highway. It goes from wherever to wherever. It's like 450 miles long. It's where the famous yard sale is, the 127 yard sale. Okay, we've got a golf resort here. we got a driving range here. We've got a hotel here and a country inn. And we've got the subject property. It sounds so sterile, doesn't it? It's almost 10,000 square feet. It's almost an acre. And it's a gas station and sea store. In fact, I need some gas, so I'm gonna patronize our customers. It just needs a little fluff and buff. So we call it shave and haircut. You can call it whatever you want to call it. Fluff and buff. I don't know. Fluff and buff sounds like a porn term or something. I don't know. Um, not that I know about any of that stuff. This is it. Look at this. So you've got almost 10,000 square feet of rentable square footage. I always say that and it always sounds weird. Square feet of rentable square footage. This used to be a horse tack saddle place, I think, back in the day. And then you've got this thing uh, in the middle. I haven't been inside. So I don't know. And then, of course, the sea store is over here. The pumps are in good shape. We can help you navigate through that thing to make sure that you're uh, not going to be liable in case something happens with uh, the pumps leaking and everything like that. Uh, that's like a big thing. People are like, well, what if the pumps leak? Then I'll lose my house. No, no, no. No, 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 no. We got you covered. We know how to take care of all that stuff. And But it's just, there's like no signs up. You know, it's like that's a pretty weenie sign. And here's a big tip. We know this great gas station and it's crushing it. They've got, uh, they've got a smoker in the back. They, they're making sausage. They're doing all kinds of stuff that's not like, you know, like kind. Like here, you know, you think of Cokes and Smokes and beer. Oh, they got their beer license too. But if you had a little smoker in the back and if you were doing, uh, making your own homemade sausage, which you can do, it's like not hard. You're going to have a massive amount of traffic who comes in and they're going to say, well, I'll get the gas and I'll get a bag of chips or whatever, whatever your, your money maker is there. And that could bring in a ton of people. You have to pivot. You have to think outside the box or you just sit and get stiff and old and die. That's my opinion on it. This is absolutely rentable. I think he's paying 6500 a month. Remember, I talked to you about cash flow. If you were to buy this whole thing, your payments would only be like maybe uh, about maybe three or four thousand a month. If you were to pay cash, then your payments are nothing. You can't do that with a government bond or a money market or any of that stuff. You just can't. Uh, you know, you might get half of that. So sixty five hundred dollars could really change your family's uh, future, right? Sixty five hundred dollars a month. That'd barely pay my wine bill. Just kidding. If you want to do something like that, you know, let's think out of the box a little bit here. In fact, let's think outside the car here a little bit. This is a big parking lot. You could do, hey, this is 
Mustang weekend and you have all the Mustangs come in. You, you literally have enough to fit, you know, probably 50 or 100 cars here. And so it's Mustang weekend or, you know, it's the first Saturday of the month. Then you have Corvettes one weekend. You have antique trucks and you have anything that's collectible, you know. So you could do that. That brings people in. But you can't just park your car there. The owner's going to kill me when he sees this video. You can't just park your car there and expect people to come. I mean, I know it looks like there's somebody there, but you can clearly see that it's the owner just parking out there. That's just not good marketing. Just talk to me about marketing. I'll help you. Now, he knows I'm coming, but I'm a little late, but that's okay. That's Brad style. Just a little bit late. He's got to paint it all up nice and everything. Looks good. Inside, it just is a little long in tooth. We got to just buff, fluff and buff, baby. Fluff and buff. They take credit cards. That's a good thing. I don't know how the pumps work. I'll ask him. You know, when, how can you get new pumps and stuff like that? Good to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Yeah. No problem, my man. All right, good. I don't know anything about the convenience store business. Can you just give me some bullet points? So convenience store ordered the profit? Yeah, like what's the where are the profits? It, do you make money on the gas or the gas just, just gets people in here? <laughs> <laughs> Is that how it works? <laughs> gas uh it's okay. We are did like 10, 15 percent. Ten or fifteen percent, okay. Candy. Like 35 to 30. Okay. Yeah. Soda, same. But it's the volume, I guess, right? Huh? It's the volume. Yeah. Right? So that's yeah. really important to have people in and buying yeah, everything. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You have volume, <coughs> then you get it. And I don't have volume, that is a problem. Right. Yeah, that's yeah. a problem. Uh, what are your hours here? Hours? Too many. For sure. <laughs> yes, sir. Seven to uh, six, six to 11. 6 to 11? Yeah, but uh, seven. I start in the 7 to 11, yeah. What do you uh, do with all that extra time at night? <laughs> nothing, because we're living here. So that's, oh, you live here, okay. Yeah, that's why. All so right. anyway, go home. Just better stay here so I give you good service. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that's why. Yeah. Yeah, I was teasing because that's almost not enough to uh, sleep almost, right? <laughs> yeah, 7 to 10. And winter time, let us be early sometime. How the weather, nice weather, we're standing here. I try to... More people coming. Yeah. But you don't have a too tra traffic here too much. Yeah. I work for Ken. Oh, Ken. Oh, yeah, okay. yeah. I work for Ken. Understand about the business. What's good, what's bad. I, I, obviously, the hours are bad. <laughs> I know. No hours is bad, but yeah. uh, traffic problem. Yeah. Yes, traffic problem. What kind of marketing do you do? Do you have a website or anything like that? No. No. Okay. No, because everybody knows that road. Okay, right, <laughs> uh, that's yeah, right. We open. I that's... have a sign outside, uh, open sign and uh, window. Okay. And I uh, have a lighting good. Right. Everything I have. Yeah, the lighting is nice. I like yeah, that. It's yeah. got it's all these yeah. like LED yeah, lights. LED, that's yeah, good. good. Inside is the LED, outside is the LED. I so do you do anything that you've got? Um, you've got charcoal. Uh, everything you got, I got. You got everything, right? Yeah. What moves the most? What do you sell the most of? Beer. Beer. Yeah. Okay. Cigarette. Now, Pop. do you get a lot of people that come from the, the golf resort to buy beer? Sometimes golf, yes. Okay. Local people is a slow, yeah. Local people slow. Slow. But the, because you have a five star open. Yeah. That's why too much hurt that stuff. That hurts you. Yeah. Were you doing more business before they opened? Let her be more. Okay. Not too much. Okay. Only that golf start that time is okay. Okay. But uh, after uh, like local and traffic, no, because here everybody knows the and the car, the car, okay, and behind and the car, so nobody turn. Maybe region. Right. This region. We have so many regions. So. Yeah. Now but you don't. I can. Huh? You don't cook food like uh, I breakfast. I used to. How was that? No good. I lost too much money. I mm -hmm. have a pizza. I have a daily, no good. No good. Because a uh, golf open, that time he make one and a food. And do, at that time, what? I don't know. He have a restaurant. Oh, okay. Oh, so. And a golf, that's why they store. Okay. Yeah. So the food didn't go good here. Okay. I used to selling, but I lost too much money. Yeah. I yeah. try everything. Now, do you own this business? No. 
rent uh, it. Or the building, I mean. Yes, but rent you, it. You, you rent it? Yes, sir. Okay. When is that lease up? January. January. Yep. And you're out? Yep. Now, what are you going to do with all this stuff? I take it with you. Okay. Yeah. And if somebody come in and same business, he buy, I'm selling for him. Sell the inventory? Yep. Okay. And the racks and everything? Yeah, everything. Now, I these have. racks are all yours and everything here? He's mine. No, he's mine. They're yours. It's nothing. Okay. Ice machine is mine. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. So, but the, like the coolers where the beer is. Yeah. Beer cooler is okay. That beer goes beer with the property. Uh, vendor cooler, yes. I have only one cooler is mine. Okay. Oh, you've got a lot of coolers. Yeah. Okay. So this is where the food was. Yes, right here in the pool. But okay. It's not good work. Okay. Huh. That's why we close. Ice cream or nothing? Nothing. Ice cream right here. Oh, you got ice cream? Yeah, I got ice cream. Oh, okay, okay, got Whatever it. Whatever you need a convenience store, I have everything. Okay. Yeah. Convenience store, I carry everything. Salesman no coming. I request for him, salesman. Lala, he said, no, your business. No business. That's why salesman no coming. Huh. Ice people. I call, I, I have used to ice machine. We have spent like three, four hundred dollars for put outside light. And he said, man, you're no good sell. I said, no problem. So I make my own. So machine. you make your own? Own machine. Okay. But so one, you got that and then, uh, uh, oh, yeah. okay, there you go. What's your biggest expense? Like electric or? Electric is uh, $1,200, I pay, yeah. $1,200. Yes, too much electric. And then the rent? Rent is okay, rent is not bad, but uh, electric, electric and uh, plus, yeah. Okay. Sometimes we have whatever. My wife and I, we own commercial property. Oh, okay. So we rent it out. So it's important to us to know all the details because we were thinking about maybe buying this. Oh, your wife? Yeah, my wife and I. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> you you know. like it, then you're okay. Yeah. Have, we are spending the more money here. We do everything. I make this one. Is my Come son. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, so yeah. this goes out? This comes out? Too? No, no, no. No, the, no that stays. <laughs> but you do things yourself to save money. Yes. Got it. Yeah, right. Got it. What a nice area. Well, yeah, you want to make it nice. What's the rent here? What do you pay rent for the building? Right now, me, it's like 15000 It's nothing. Right. A, a month? 20000 15000 A month? Yeah, a month. Yeah. So that's that's right. nothing. No. Yeah. It's not bad rent, I told you that. Rent is yeah. not bad, but no. no business. Yeah, right. Yeah. That's the stinker. Yeah. But because uh, I go to work and more make money. Yes. But my health is a problem. You see, I have a health problem, you know? So that's why I don't go work and I live alone right now. Mm -hmm. My health is okay. I go to work, I make more money. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. What What do you What should this be making? That location? Mm -hmm. I don't know, man. You have a like fifty thousand dollar business is a good business. Okay. It's okay. Yeah. Okay. And that's the right. So it's like you survive, you know, and later be you make it. Okay. But, uh, I don't think so that make it fit it up because you have five star already offer. I don't think so. They're yeah. they're they're doing probably yeah, a, yeah, a, a hundred a week. Yep. Or a hundred a month. More than. More than a hundred a month. He's selling it a lot of gas and everything and cheaper selling. And it's a new store. Yeah. 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 And plus it's a good parking. Mm hmm That important. Well you have a lot of parking. I know, but that's problem. People come in you don't see in the store. Oh, uh, yeah. You understand? That's problem. Have you ever put like a big sign up or something? That... You have a sign already. You... Oh, okay. You have the sign. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Got it. We have a sign already. Okay. But somebody that you, you do it, you say your wife do it, I don't mind. That's yeah. fine. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But uh, I don't think so that somebody comes. I don't know. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, I hope maybe somebody come in and nicely and good. Yeah, I don't care. I go to somewhere and working. Um, can you and, show me around? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And he buy my inventory. That's easy for me. Sure. Yeah, yeah. the inventory. That would be the yeah. best. Yeah. <clears throat> the electric bill doesn't sound that high. With all these, you because can have here? Because there's too many cooler, yes. you got a lot of yeah. coolers. And you put in the like this walking cooler, 
so let it be cheaper. But this is the basement. So I don't think so. Everything is like you know that after water leaking and mess up downstairs. That Which part. is worse, this for leaking or this? Everything leaking. Everything leaks. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It's like a. A beer cave. Yeah, that beer. Yeah. No. On the beer vessel. And they come and they they bring the beer here. Yeah, people bring the beer. Yeah. They put it inside delivery. Budweiser, Southern Bud Spirits, or yeah, whatever. Yeah, and then what do you have back here? Is this living quarters or is living downstairs? I live in downstairs. Okay. Happy. I have a half inch this one, but I never using. <laughs> you have what? That's my house downstairs. Okay. All right. Great. Yes. Great. That's why we work in the long hours. Otherwise, I go somewhere, no work. Yeah, and, right. Yes. You can't do that. Yes, yeah. Yes, yes. And this is just a closet, okay? Yes. All right. All right. And there's your security cameras. Do you ever have any theft or anything? Huh? Do people ever steal things? People stealing, yes. But what do you do? He's yeah. like, that's the America habit. He knows that. Yeah. <laughs> And convenience store is it? He's it's no big deal. Yeah. Yeah. But you don't have like a baseball bat. Just, and you can hit people. I don't know, no. <laughs> Something you have a, like a big problem. That's why I need a security. Right. Otherwise, I don't need it. Right. You know. Yeah. Yeah. Little stuff. Yeah. Don't worry about I that. I never looking. Sometimes cops come in and some happen outside, and he tell he say, "Raji, you have a camera." I said, "Look, this camera." You want to look, I give a number and go ahead, I see. Right, yeah, that's yeah. right. But that's I help you. Otherwise, I never open. I only see sometimes dealings people I tell. I say, please, man, I don't have too much business. Right. Why dealings? Right. Uh, sometimes he listen. After he's okay, again start. And mostly the kids and old lady. Kids and old ladies. <laughs> Really? <laughs> you want to go downstairs? Yeah, no. Sure, yeah. Yeah, yeah you take your go. suit, please. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah take yeah. your shoes off. That's no yeah, problem. Please. Yes. Right here, that's my house. Be sleeping here. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Yes. Do you have lights? I, I make the nice, uh, Nice basement, cleaning up, and nice, I make everything, see? Yeah. Yeah, it's very nice. Yes. You have fireplace and everything. Yes, everything. Bedroom? Bedroom? It, nothing, everything. Okay. Yeah, just bedroom. Bathroom? Yeah. No, no, bedroom, all bedroom. Okay, One, all three, three bedrooms, okay. Five. Right here, that's good. Right here. Okay. That bathroom. Okay, that bathroom. bathroom. That is the electric part. Okay. Electric ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mechanical room. Yes. Electric. Electric. AC and everything. Yes. Water and everything. Okay, you got gas. Nice. Yeah. That's good. Okay. And then this is the outside. Yes, sir. All right. Huh. Great. There you go, buddy. All right. All righty. This is nice. Yeah, this is really nice. You could sit out here and... I know, but you don't need to sit down. When it rains? You need some money. <laughs> That's a true story. Right. You have money, then you're happy. That's right. Right. Although I'm sorry. I get it. I get it. It's a nice, quiet here. You know? Yeah. Yeah. You want to see? Sure, please. Yeah, one second. I think it. Oh, wow. What are these? It's nothing. Okay. Okay. We have too much mess up. Oh, with the roof. The roof, water, water. I don't use nothing, this one. Okay. 
And same with the basement and the downstairs. Same, same size, right? Yes, sir. Yeah. No water. Only light is the same place. Same light. Same so electric bill. The electric bill is the same here? Same. After using this one, he come in more. Okay. So that's he need a separate. Okay. Right here, big man. Okay, all right. Are there lights on down there or no? Yes, 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 sir. Okay. There you go. Ah, nice. All right. Wow, a lot more space down here. Okay. Another bathroom? Yes. Yep. Outside. But no water, huh? Mmm. <laughs> Okay, there we go. Perfect. Then this just goes up and loops around? Up there, yeah. Okay. 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 It feels good and solid. And there's a little sink there. Okay. Is that everything? Did I see everything? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. somebody. Get it sold. Somebody looking and somebody buy maybe. It's a dream for someone. Yeah. It's a dream. Yeah. I have a basement and the light right now. I own. So just you come in. You have a side and a step. Okay. Pick it off, please. All right. I'll do that. I save my money. You know that. <laughs> That's right. That's right. You don't waste. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> now, these are the tanks, right? Huh? These are the tanks. What kind of gas? Uh, tanks, the, the gas tanks? Just tank, yeah. Just gas tank. I don't okay. know, maybe some problem, maybe can be the two old. Okay. I'm not saying that he's doing it wrong. He's doing it right for him. But could you do so much better? The answer is yes, of course. So you could rent this out here. That's the daycare. I have no idea what this is. Oh, that's that little spot in the middle. What would you do with that? You could probably rent that out to uh, to either another, uh, like an office. You know, maybe an accountant or something would want a small office like that. Or something that's a complimentary business. Think about complimentary businesses. If you got beer, beer and gas, you might want uh, maybe, maybe a barbecue guy here. You put the, uh, put the food truck right there. They can use their hot boxes in here, like uh, Henny Penny or something like that, Alto Sham and maybe to have some sit down. You just gotta think a little bit, but this is not a, uh, this is not a bad deal. I said, I said, you ever think of putting up a sign? He said, I have a sign. So to me, where are we? To me, that's not much of a sign. What do they call those arm flailing inflatable tube man? <laughs> you know, so I'd have something out there. Heck, I tell you, if this was my place and I wasn't getting enough customers, I'd run around naked out on that highway if I had to, to get people in. You got to do what you got to do. You got to pivot. You got to make people come in. You got to host chamber parties or whatever. Hey, come on in and see the new place. And that way everybody will know. And they'll say, hey, you know, that guy, he's doing some stuff. He's cleaning up. He's making it better. And people will patronize you. Anyway, that's just my thought in business. What the hell do I know? I know a lot about business because I've got three or four very successful businesses. Anyway. Love y'all. Here are the stills. We'll have more later. This is difficult. It's a lot. You know, it's like 10,000 square feet and almost an acre of blacktop. We got plenty, plenty of room to do lots and lots of things here. What would you do? Comment below. Don't forget to like. If you like this video, like, subscribe, watch another video. Ciao.